It's the fact that I actively right now have to pee and didn't decide to do that before going live. I make great decisions. I don't know who you've been talking to, but <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So we have some productivity sprints today because this girl forgot how to read. I haven't read anything in weeks. Okay. I've been destroyed. It's like house of leaves all over again. Um, don't love that for me, but what we're going to do, uh, is I'm going to have, so something that I do on Patreon is, or that I've recently started doing and, um, is that I've had my like Duchess tier. There's only two tiers, but like the Duchess tier, um, have the ability to join me for the sprints. So if you see people pop up, oh, hi, hey, hi. Ashley. She was here with me last night on Patreon. Yeah. Dang, hey. how much sleep did you get? I got a good amount. <laughs> Not much. Yeah. Normal for me. I'm normally, I normally don't get a lot of sleep. <laughs> we cannot say that for the rest of the people on that live. That is. Yeah. Yeah. Bowen's like, it's 6 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so we, um, just to let you know if you see things like uh, back and forth, is that, um, that, so there can only be nine people at a time on StreamYard. So if you're on my Patreon and you're trying to join, it's not that your computer's messed up. It's that if there's nine people, that's where it caps it out. And then if someone leaves, then someone else can join. So if you see somebody leave and also do not feel bad about leaving, like I'm not going to feel bad. Like we're here for a very long time. Okay. Let wait. <gasps> Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Oh my gosh. Wait, Maya, which Maya are you? You, there's two Mayas. Adams. Adams. Maya M. Adams. You're um paired with. I think Alyssa. Alyssa. Oh, <laughs> good luck. <laughs> <laughs> good luck Sarah which um who did you get matched with Claire oh cute oh my gosh <laughs> okay speaking of we spoke her into being <laughs> I wasn't gonna join public sprints but if Maya's here hello Hi. look at y'all right next to each other how cute <laughs> <laughs> I love that. If you don't know what we're talking about, um, was that, so I did this thing or I'm doing, we are doing this thing on Patreon for the month of June and I need to make the graphic for that. That's the first thing that I need to answer. But, um, it's called the Tinder like readathon. So basically I had people like fill out a Google form with way too many questions on it. I don't know why I did that to myself, but fill out this form of like what their favorite, like top 10 favorite books are, books, top 10 like books that they thought they were gonna like, that they didn't, blah, 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 favorite tropes, favorite genre. And then I went through and like matched who I thought would be the closest like reading taste wise together. And then and this is also a PSA for anybody that wasn't there yesterday because I haven't made the graphic telling y'all anything, but um, it is a... Uh, going to be in in june i sent everybody either on your instagram the graphic of who you're matched with and why um or i sent it to your email if i couldn't get a couldn't find your instagram or you don't have one and what's so funny is the people that don't have instagrams got paired together which i think is hysterical <laughs> there's like five people that didn't what's have. so funny is the people that don't have instagram is that me <laughs> hello busy hello again hi yes. hello. Hello. Wait. Wait, what? Amy won't join, but she's making sure we keep you on topic. <laughs> <laughs> she might be at work. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe yeah. it's because she was there for like seven hours yesterday. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's gonna be um understood. Respect. Respect. Um, hey. You should join. Um, I okay. So basically, what it is is I sent it and I sent the ten books that they had picked, the ten books that you would pick, and then you can either pick books that they have listed that you have not read in hopes that y'all have similar tastes and you will also enjoy it, 
Or if you don't want to do that, then just talk with the other person and be like, hey, this is what I'm looking for right now. Do you have any suggestions that you like? And then we're going to spend like the month of um, June. One, reading books that we hope the other person is going to like, but also just making new bookish friends because it just makes it like more personal and you can talk to each other better. Ha ah! Hello. Oh my gosh. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I'm like, I can never, ever, ever join these, but today I can. <laughs> Wait, where do you live? I'm in uh, Chattanooga, Tennessee. That's not so too far. I'm, I'm really close to you. Yeah, I'm down in Atlanta all the time. Oh, well. Oh. Mm. <laughs> she, she, she says that, and then she actually walks in frame. Nice. <laughs> 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 Meanwhile, I stayed up because it's almost one here. It's 26 past 12. Oh my goodness. Well, um, I, I appreciate you. Oh my God. <laughs> that is crazy. Maddie, who did you get uh, matched with? Because I know you were on there. I didn't fill it out. There's a girl <gasps> named Maddie on there. Is there two Maddies? It's not me. Hmm. 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 I'll be your Tinder match. Oh, wait, y'all. <laughs> <gasps> Hello. Oh, my gosh. Okay. We have never, we have not formally met Travis. No. R resident one of, like, six men. <laughs> yes. I think, like, maybe, like, three, back. <laughs> maybe less. Three. Three. Close enough, right? <laughs> but we know them all by name because they all comment. All are cool. We're including it's not a high bar to live up to, honestly. It's really not. <laughs> I remember when my brother joined and he was on the Discord and he was like, kind of like, oh, this is like, like, oh, it kind of standoffish. I was like, it's because you're a man. You need to give it a minute and let people warm up to you because they're expecting the worst. I'm just going to say it. It happens. It happens. Amy said, a man. A man. A white man. A no. white man. No. <laughs> <laughs> yes <laughs> oh yes okay tell us tell us what you're gonna buy you know today this is so funny i i did go to that doctor's appointment and it was just a ct scan which is so expensive for what fucking reason anyway um i went there and did that and then as i was leaving i was like oh i need to go and get hydrogen peroxide like i was telling you all yesterday to bleach these um uh, sweaters for my mom and I was like, let me see where, like, if there's a Walmart, or I was like, I'll just drive home and go to that Walmart. I get 0.2 miles away from the hospital. There's a Walmart. And I thought, Katie, like, don't go to the bookstore. Like, don't even look up how close Half Price Books is. Like, you don't need to do that. You bought 11 books when you're in Florida. And then I was like, I need to buy Rit Dye for these sweatshirts. And I was like, oh, maybe I can find a Joann's. At Walmart, across the street, Joann's. Next to Joann's. Home goods. Next to home goods, half price books. Oh my God. <laughs> it was a miracle. <laughs> and of course, I did buy something, which I did not need to, but I couldn't resist. They had volumes one and two of my dress up darling. Oh, I like mm. that one. I've heard really she, good things about that. Yeah, I think I'm up to um, volume four on that one. Is it continuing? Yes, I think, but it's a very short series. I think it's only like nine. I think it's only going to be like nine or ten when it finishes in um, Japan. Well, I appreciate that because you know we're here for a good time, not a long time. Yeah. So that was great. And then I also was like, I invented Joanne's in so long, and they and I was like, I'm just gonna buy a bunch of like these little charms and stuff. And I was like, I'm gonna make my own jewelry. <laughs> ah, when the hobby bug bites. <laughs> well, you go into the Joann's and you're like, that's on sale? Wait, that's on sale? Wait, that's on sale? I need it. It's basically the target of creativity. Mm -hmm. True. You go in and they've put something into the air conditioner that forces you to buy things. I it's not our fault. It's like not. The store makes <laughs> you do it. Exactly. Has anybody that's here dislike, which it's only been like, 10 hours of which I'm sure y'all were sleeping, but have any of y'all decided on a book that you're thinking about wanting to read for the readathon? I'm going to read fourth wave. 
That's what I'm reading right now. Oh, sorry. Let's go to, okay. My bad. I forgot to explain this. Um, that, uh, so we'll start with like, if I ask a question or whatever, like I'll, I'll answer it and then we'll go to Ashley and then Sarah and we'll like go in order. Um, I haven't like completely decided, but I am definitely, uh, leaning more towards the invisible life of Addie LaRue. Good choice. Yeah. Good choice. All right. Sarah, what are you thinking? I, I'm looking at the list as we speak. I think I'm going to read Sandman. Mm. Wait, was this was the person who also, was this the person who also had the Chaos Walking trilogy on there? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I was like, I was like, that one was like somebody who kind of leaned more like sci-fi fantasy and like, and stuff like that. And I was like, okay, this is hard because I thought more people would have that, but nobody else really did. Yeah, but it was fine for me because I read everything. I just don't read historical fiction and liter literary fiction. Other than that, I read everything. <laughs> and they don't either. So, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> hey, Maya, what are you thinking? Because I know I... it's a tough egg to crack. So I picked the one book that she didn't put on her list that she had mentioned yesterday. I did. I, I forgot about it. Murder Your Employer. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. absolutely stunning. You know, part of me is thinking about because I'm going to read Fourth Wing because Amy suggested it and she didn't fill out the form, Amy. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, oh my God. Okay, literally speaking into being like every time. <laughs> oh, hi. Were you talking about me? <laughs> I think you might have said it three times. Oh. Mm. Sorry. But I was like, okay, so I want to read. Can you hear that? It's okay. not me. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I want to read Fourth Wing because Amy loved it and she's an admin on my Patreon. But then I also think I want to read um, How to Murder Your Employer for Alyssa. It's so good. It's <laughs> so good. Um, Amy doesn't count because she's not participating. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Next time. A little heads up on the form, okay? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yeah. It was like 1 a.m. in a hotel in Florida, and I was like, well, I'm awake. Let's make it and send it out. Yeah. All right, Travis, what are you thinking? So me and Austin, like, really hit it off. Um, and he, like, sent me a list of things, and I was like, yeah, I'll just read them all. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm going to do They Never Learn... Uh, Daisy Jones in the Six. Um, what was the other? Uh, Young Mungo. And I think I'm just going to do Fourth Wing just because like everybody else is doing it. So it's like an unofficial like group book type thing. True. Mm -hmm. Those are great choices. I would I would say that uh, Daisy Jones in the Six, in, in my experience, is a better audio book than a physical yep. book. So. All right, so I put the hold in four already. Mm. Nice. And uh, Maddie did not get, she was not the Maddie who no. was in the form. <laughs> My bad. But is there, it, like, is there anything that you're going to be reading this month? I'm reading Fourth Wing. So, sounds like you didn't see you. You need to it's read it too. Unofficial book club pick. <laughs> <laughs> All because of Amy being like, look at these sprayed edges. Do you know if you run to the bookstore right now, you can still get one? <laughs> yeah. Okay, busy. What are you thinking? Um, so I am definitely one of those people where I'm going to go, hey, where are y'all going? I'm going to go with you. So I probably will go ahead and just read Fourth Wing. Just says, I'm always the one who's late to read. Like, I was late to the whole, um, like, oh, God, Dowry of Blood train. I was late to the, um, the prom one. Way to Blood? Way to Blood. Dowry of Blood and Way to Blood. I was out on all the Bloods. Well, the Waiter Blood didn't come out that long ago, so I feel like you did pretty good. Yep. So now I think I need to read Fourth Wing. I need a message, my match, to get some recommendations because I've read all the books on their list except for Inu Inuyasha, and I can't make that commitment. That yeah. that sucker is long. Well, they. I was hoping because the person you got matched with only listed like 
three or four things. And you know what? It's, some people didn't understand the assignment. It's okay. It's okay. You know, they tried, they filled it out. But I was assuming that, well, one, because like you're more of a um, vocational person. What am I trying to say? Like more like a engaging person, like willing to reach out that I was like, I was assuming that if you reach out to them, that you could get them to like tell you more books that they like. Because yeah, I just no need way to reach they out. only like three books. Yeah, I just need to reach out. Oh my God. I'll give him. Speaking of men we love. Gap, gap. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. It's very oh, cool. Very Travis, cool. just so you know, once you've read They'll Never Learn, you're officially completely part of the group. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited mm -hmm. for it. I can't wait. I've been putting it off for so long. That's a prerequisite. To yep. being yeah. funny. It's on the pre prerequisite uh, reading, mm -hmm. the required mm -hmm. reading. Okay. <laughs> that was like when, um, whenever I was doing the, I was doing that like collab intro with Sarah from Sarah Without an H and I was telling her the books to read and I'd gone on her Goodreads. I was like, how have you flown under the radar of the booktube police? Because she has not read Vicious or The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue. And I was like, that's a prerequisite to be here. Like, what are you talking about? Yeah, at least one of them. <laughs> I haven't read neither. And my name is Sarah, so maybe it's I, that kind of thing. <laughs> and also it's also Sarah read. without an age. <laughs> Already yeah. I haven't. <laughs> I <laughs> No words. No. I've read Addie, but I never read Vicious. It's so good. A book Alyssa and I both love. I loved it. So that's saying a lot. <laughs> but I haven't read Addie, and I never will. When I was at the so bookstore, something I thought was like, I was like, this is shelved improperly. There's no way. Is In the clearance section at the bookstore, they had Nevermore, and it was a perfect edition. And I was like, what? That's crazy. <laughs> the red rebel bunny roll. That's hilarious. You'd be it's surprised when it comes to like retail. Like if someone bought the book and returned it, that can sometimes automatically put something on clearance. True. Yeah. Yeah. Or was it a hardcover? No, it was a paperback. Oh. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're all being treated like independent bookstores now. So at the store, isn't moving it, then they can get rid of it and stock things that the other stores aren't. Mm -hmm. Maybe there was something wrong with it because there was only one that was on sale. The rest of them were in the normal. But I was like, weird. I mean, maybe there was something wrong with it. I didn't flip through it. I just saw the spine and was like, that doesn't look fucked up. Oh my God, Jerew never comes in time to join the gals. And the pals, let's see, what are we gonna, what are we actually, you know what? I know this is not on Patreon, but all of y'all are. What are we naming this cat? Because it doesn't have a name and that's just not okay. Mm -hmm. Let me show you the cat. Mm -hmm. Because I do think that the meow is terrifying, but <laughs> she's so cute. Do you wanna do 40? Uh, Thirty-five, forty, or forty-five. Forty-five. Yeah. Yeah, I need to read this book. <laughs> oh my god, you were so small. I feel like the cat should be named Violet because it's oh. the character of Fourth Wing, <laughs> and that's the moment. That's right a now. great one. Yes. Also, the background is purple. I love that because it makes me think of um, Violet. Uh, oh my God. Baudelaire? Baudelaire, yeah. That's what I thought too. And I was like, oh, there is someone named Violet in this book I've been reading for the past <laughs> two days. Oops. There is, yes. <laughs> there is. I forgot that. How far are you in the uh, book, Alyssa? Um, I'm on page, well, I'm on page 93. So like, I'm at the beginning of seven. So I've read 15 pages since last night because I came home from work and I took a really long nap instead of reading. Well, I'll have to so. check because I'm on 114. So I'm like right ahead of you. You're so close to like so, good stuff. <laughs> good, it's, 
I wouldn't say I'm not a good stuff yet. So even better is coming. Better stuff is coming. Okay, so yeah, now I'm like really intrigued. I I don't want okay, I, I want to read it so bad. And I know that I can't just start reading it right now because I'm in this like weird, like not reading mood. And I'm like, I need to ease my way into it because I don't want to start reading it and then be like, I don't feel like reading mm -hmm. and put it down and not like mm -hmm. taint the book for me. So I'm like, Katie, got to go in with the best mindset possible. Maybe start with a manga. I mean, this, I was flipping through it. And the reason I got it, because I was like, okay, I'm not like a huge slice of life. I'm not a huge like romance person, but this artwork, Oh, it's gorgeous. It's hot too. I was like, what? Yeah. I mean, it does employ the the, the big boob, look at my, my skirt type thing, but it's really well drawn. <gasps> okay, let us know. I am too scared to read it and I need I need to know if it's amazing. Because I hope it I need it to be. What? Where do you get it? Uh, I heard um, it's really good. I'm really excited for that. It's McKay um, yeah. on BookTube. And if you go, so he has a video talking about it and it's on his Instagram, but there's links to it. It's on Amazon and you can either get a paperback or you can get an ebook. And I think the ebook's like $6 hmm. or $5 or something. Um, and it's an extreme horror. And I believe it's like a shorter book, but he's, a, he's an extreme horror booktuber. Um, and he's just a really awesome guy. So we well, he loves Survivor. So yeah. I will not, I will be unfortunately unable to support, but I am sending love. No, yeah. Let me see. I want to see if he has a little, does he have a little, oh, he has a good read. Ah, my God, so cute. <laughs> oh my God, that cover? Mm hmm Shot. Yeah, the only bad thing that someone said about it on Goodreads was that it needed to be longer. That's the only like bad thing that uh -huh. I saw is that they needed more of it. So I need to read it. Oh my God, one of the patrons has read it, Kayla Bellers. Let's see what people are saying about it. Oh, that's so good for him. Okay, I'm just reading things at this point. Okay, let's, no, I did not realize, he did not accurately like post about this because I did not realize even after watching that video and seeing it on Instagram multiple times, he did not accurately show how stunning it is like he was just the photo in the corner i'm like no bitch that needed to be the full screen <laughs> yeah yes okay um we're gonna do our first sprint and look at that we have been talking for less than 30 minutes before our first sprint <laughs> wow <laughs> it's a record it is a record. Yeah. <laughs> it'll Fine. never happen again <laughs> Oh, <laughs> well, I don't know if that's overwhelming. Okay, Amy, do you think, should should we do the the spreadsheet or is it like too much because it's uh, public? I would or I say, could just do it on Patreon. If, if you want to do it, I would say just do Patreon people only because otherwise like we may find a way to break the spreadsheet with this many people. <laughs> a lot of people. <laughs> And then also, yeah, that's a good idea because I don't want people to have the link to be able to fuck it up. Yeah. For the rest of us. I can set up a new page for us. Oh my God. She's, she's like, I will actually create a whole other spreadsheet. <laughs> it's like basically what we do is, um, well, we've just started doing it because it's new. But um. But it's like a Google spreadsheet where there's a column for like your name. There's a column for what you want to get, like tasks you want to get done, books you're reading, and then a column for things you got done, and then a column for how many pages that you've read. Um, and you get and you see live like uh, everyone's progress, and it's just really cool. And it's an easier way. And having to like look like, through all the comments and be like, what was it you were just reading? And then at the end, we can total up how many pages everyone read as a group. 
Oh yeah, there was one day where it was like over a thousand or something. It was like crazy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we didn't look last night because last night was just chaos. <laughs> it was like four hundred and something, Ooh. but we we didn't read so <laughs> not much. Okay, I'm gonna do a sprint, and if you're on Patreon, I'm going to post the link to the spreadsheet for the duchesses, and then um. Mm. Ashley, don't don't you post videos? Yeah. Okay, I was like, I thought I've seen your face. <gasps> oh my god, Anna's so funny in the chat. Please, <laughs> girl. <laughs> That's hilarious. No, that that is good. Anna is my book twin, mm -hmm. by the way. Rebecca, Katie's how, dare you, how dare you come into my house mm -mm. and ask me that? <laughs> oh, thank you. Mar Mariah's like, Mariah's like, I've read they never learn. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> you'll see it. Okay, Corinne, uh, you'll see it because I'm going to post it for you um, if you haven't seen it before. We've only done it twice. Okay, um, I'm going to do a sprint and then I need to make the Tinder announcement thingy graphic. Okay. Let's uh, all go on mute. If you can't go on mute, if you're using a phone or you can't reach it, then I can mute you. So you don't need to worry about it. Okay. Let's do our first sprints.
Hello. How? How did we do? I was going to, oh, it's kind of aesthetic. Um, I was going to, what did I say I was going to do? Well, I was, I was going to start editing. I did make the post on Patreon and I was going to start editing, but I got this notification saying that I only have like 0.6 of a gigabyte left of storage because I didn't realize that the HD, or not the HD, the 4K footage takes up like a shit ton of space, but I can't delete it because I'm not done with anything. So we were dealing with that. And then also, I mean, y'all will know, but the uh, that little like thing, like little countdown that I, or not the countdown, but the, the tallier for every time I say sorry in this video, mm -hmm. I'm trying to make that look good. So that's what I did. What about you, Ashley? Um, I read, uh, I started the audio book for it. Uh, what? We're actually, I'm on channel four. I started it like, yeah, really good. It's cutting out a little bit for you. Would, um, could you put the name of the book that you're reading, like, either in the comments or like, or say it one more time. What was that? Oh, I said it was, um, it was cutting out. <laughs> um, so I couldn't hear what book it is that you started. I think, I think my, my connection is bad. Mm. Mm. That sucks. What were you on yesterday? Because it wasn't doing this yesterday. I don't want to start talking because I know that, that she's <laughs> that we're going to hear. Um, <laughs> but it could be the part of the house that you're in too. Um, is maybe like too far away from your Wi-Fi. But when that comes back, we will come back to the audiobook that she just started listening to. I, I just missed the title. Um, so Sarah, what were you doing? I'm three, um, 33% mm -hmm. into Daisy Jones and the Six. My first time reading it. And it's really mm -hmm. good. It's better than I thought it was. Because sometimes when people hype up things, I think it can't be that good. But it's really good. Good. I'm glad. Yeah, I love that book. And I, it was one that I wouldn't thought that I would have loved. But yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it's really good. The interview format works in the audiobook. So we all moved around. So I know, I everything shifted. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you, will, you know, Sarah already went. So now it's, now it's Maya's turn. No, actually, you know what? One, it's Maya's turn, but we've got to move. Oh, God. We've got to... <laughs> Y'all need to put us next to each other. <laughs> and you know what? Let's just have the whole Brady Bunch. <laughs> okay. Oh, busy. Perfect. She put it in her title just in case. Um, yeah. You started reading that last night, right? Um, I actually didn't. Um, I said I was going to, and then I just read some children's picture books instead. That's funny. Um, I have now started it. I've read 55 pages. Nice. It's really um, good. It starts okay. off really strong. So I just need to know, like, no spoilers, but I don't need to worry anything about, like, animal cruelty, do I? It, there, There is animal cruelty. But there's not animal death. Okay. No, not death. Not death, but there is some cruelty. Hmm. Because I'm like, right now, I really don't care if, like, who, who dies in this book, but I'm going to come for you if anything happens to the dog. Yeah, th there was an early on Goodreads review that was like, just FYI, the dog lives. That's all you need to know. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> then I'm good. Yeah. Then I'm good. I the dog always, whenever there's a pet in a thriller, I'm like, you better not do it. Don't do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kill everyone else. I don't care. 
Mm-hmm. Don't worry about the dog, but it's but but there is some cruelty. That's all I need to know. Don't worry about the dog. Okay, next. I'm reading Fourth Wing. I'm fangirling to Amy over it right now. I'm hoping <laughs> to keep loving it. But you know, I like an enemies. I don't really like a lovers. So as of right now in the enemy stage, loving it. <laughs> Later on, I don't know. I don't know. But no, I'm like screaming. This book is is a fun little fun little little sexual tension time. I'm yeah. so happy. Alyssa just got to a reveal that I've been like, what, when are you going to get there? <laughs> um, so I'm in school so, right now. So I just had to watch a lecture for my class. And then I'm about to do some questions and answers for the discussion post. Mm. Yeah. Working. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, same, technically. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I ate dinner and I read like three pages of my book and made coffee. So oh, wait, from below, is that Darcy? No, it's Darcy, Darcy Coates. Yeah, I saw that at the bookstore today, and I stopped myself from getting it because I picked it up. I stopped myself because I was like, "Isn't that the one that Haley Hughes said that the concepts always sound really good, but that she like isn't a fan of?" I can't remember. I wasn't sure, so I put it down. This one has really high ratings, and it's usually on people's like best Darcy Coates list because it's her shipwreck horror. So yeah. I'll keep you posted. Damn. Travis, what you do? Oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, no, I took I took my dog for a walk and then um, I did like 15 chapters of Dragon Ball. Um, Damn. Yeah, it, they're short chapters. They're only like thirteen pages each, um, so yeah, it's only like a volume like, and a half. That was a lot. It's going well. I really like it though. Um, I, I've like watched Dragon Ball, but I haven't ever read it, and it's it's really really good so far. That's funny. My brother um, is reading his first manga right now, and he was asking me, um, well, because we're doing like a family book club, and I was like, we're gonna read Spy Family. Okay. Oh, it's uh, so good. It's so good. And they, um, he messaged me and was like, so I'm confused. Like, how do you suggest that I read this? Like, am I supposed to read it all at once? Like, should I read it a little bit at a time? And he's never read manga, but he was like, he was like, well, I used to love Dragon Ball Z. Like, not like that anime. And I was like, I was like, oh, mm-hmm. yeah, that's just, just one thing. There's a lot out there. But there there is a lot. There's a whole, whole lot, yes. I made it to... Page 128, it's a good part. <laughs> so, make it our way. I feel like I have not started this book and somehow am also her biggest advocate. <laughs> like, God, like we're getting so many people to read this. Well, Katie, I was in such a bad slump because I read a horrible, horrible, horrible book that I hated that I gave zero stars, if possible. But, and then picked this up and thought that I wouldn't want to read and I haven't put it down, so. Okay, we need to guess what yeah. this book is that you just read. It's a, I'll give you a hint. hint. It's like a newer sapphic romance. Is it the one with the, um, the like real people on the cover and it's like a wet, like one of them's leaning in and it's like a wedding? Mm-mm. Or one of them's in like a pink? Is it Asha Herring Blake? No. Ooh. Is it really popular? Uh- think so it's not like super popular it just came out like has it been a recent book of the month no i don't think so is it that new becky albertalli book i don't even know the author it's like something imogen she put it on her shelf oh the pink one the pink paperback the beth is it happy place (laughs) no it's lesbian oh damn yeah is it the um, one last stop? Uh-uh. <laughs> I'm not a romance like a person. Hint. I can't guess. Um, no romance. No romance knowledge. It's the one about the girl and her best friend's mom. Oh. Oh. Okay. I think I know. Yeah. 
Mistakes were made. Oh, oh, gagging. Okay. Gagging. <laughs> the whole way. I thought it would be fun and interesting because this shit freaks me out, but it was nasty. <laughs> so. Well, I mean, the title did warn you. It, mm. My mistake was paying full price for this book. Oh. So. Ooh. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it would be fine. I mean, the age gap is like 28 years. So it's like a wow. ch chunker. And then like the girl, the younger girl has a bad relationship with her mom. And then the mom has a bad relationship with her daughter. So they almost treat each other like mom and daughter. And it's really gross. <laughs> <laughs> Books like that just prove that the big age gap romance doesn't work no matter what gender or sexuality you're using. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. So like, gr no, doesn't matter. Mm -mm. <laughs> no, just, so just, just do not recommend. It will not let you down. <laughs> I just everything that comes out that's gay, I buy it. So <laughs> that's my own fault. <laughs> You know what? You've you've got to give it a shot. What if it had what if it had changed you and you were like, wow, I'm gonna I should date my best friend's mom. mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, Ashley. What audiobook was it that you had started? Wait, oh, sorry, one second. You're, wait. You're muted. It's not letting me unmute you. Can't unmute your guest. Their mic isn't connected. Oh no. Oh no. Ashley's going it. through it today. <laughs> Can you hear me now? I, there, you know what? I probably did. There's um there's a footage that I had where in this I, vlog that I'm opening um stuff and I haven't watched it in two weeks. So it's probably in there. I'm so sorry. Ashley, it's connected. Okay. Um, I started Feed by M Mira Grant, mm. uh, and I'm I got to chapter four. Are you doing that for the readathon? No. Okay, because that was on the, somebody's list. Yeah. This is for a. Oh, okay. okay. I just remember that was on somebody's list, and when I looked it up, I was like, Mira Grant. Shit. Yeah. Mm, see, I've seen that one. I've read all of her other ones. Is that Just don't one? do fancy flurry, flurry little dresses. I'm like a. That is the one where I'm. I'm sorry, <laughs> but this cover is hideous. Like, that's that cover is so terrible. It's just. Yeah, I guess, no. cool. this is the one I was talking about. Like, we love two hot girls, but it right. looks like a wedding magazine. Why are you at a debutante ball? <laughs> I don't know. I don't understand. <laughs> I want to love it, and I can't. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, I saw it really small, and before I zoomed in, the girl with the short dress. I don't know why it gave off like flower girl vibes, and it looked like she was in a wedding dress, and the other girl's in a flower girl dress. And I was like, I don't, oh. "What are y'all reading?" Oh no, <laughs> what are you just reading? What is this? Wow. To each their own. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so she's her best friend's stepmother. That's disgusting. Ooh. <laughs> That's a tough one. Yeah, that's, yeah. Mm, okay. Mm -mm. Well, I think it's because from afar, it looks like real people. Like, even in the bookstore, like, it looks like real people, which is not cute. But if you look at it closely, the drawing is really good. But it looks like too much like two actual people from afar. And I don't like that. I don't like real people on covers. Mm -mm. Unless it's like those KU romances where it's like a really close up shot of a guy's face and it's like abstract that I can, I can be fine with that. <laughs> you know, it, it wasn't for me. It wasn't for me. I don't know why that books everywhere. Because probably it's marketed for older women. 
Gross. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely no lesbians. Right? Where are the tattooed lesbians? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's disgusting. Disgusting. That's vile. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> that's sick. Uh, no. <laughs> okay. Um, I am hopefully going to continue editing. I kind of want to make some jewelry. So that might happen too. And I swear it's going to happen, Amy. I will put this laundry away. <laughs> you can't? <laughs> okay, well, now I'm scared. Did anybody else see it? I, I saw, saw it. it. Yeah, I saw it. I saw oh. Too. Callie? <laughs> Callie? I saw it. Okay, I'm not sure. Maybe it'll pop up for you in a little bit. I don't know. Dang. Nice. Okay. Um, we are going to do another sprint. Look at that. Only five seconds. Okay. We're going to do another sprint and we're going to get shit done. And if you forgot, go and fill out what you've gotten done on your sprints on the spreadsheet because it just makes you feel so accomplished. It makes you feel proud of yourself. Okay. Oh, that's so, shut up. That's so cute. Aww. <laughs> Connections. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Now, okay, we're really doing it. Let's go.
Hello. I had some technical Hello. difficulties. <laughs> so, do you, do, do you mean when you disappeared? Yeah, I don't know what was going on. So, my computer, I obviously wasn't editing. Um, my computer is like literally so maxed out on memory, but I'm like, I can't delete the footage because I need it, which is annoying. But um, I got into like a rabbit hole of deleting emails for some reason. Because I, I mean, I did delete some footage that I was like, okay, I guess maybe I don't need that, but I'm just trying my best. You need to get an external hard drive. You're so okay. expensive. I know. I might have a couple extra, actually. I might be able to send you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My brother is a photographer, and he doesn't really do that anymore. So we might have a few laying around. I'll look around. Let you know. I mean, I mean, I'm. Um, I'll be awkward <laughs> about it, but I'll appreciate it. <laughs> I, went, I almost bought one a couple times and I haven't because I'm like, well, I'm not going to use it. What do I, what am I going to use it for? This? Yeah. Work. It's just going to be funny. Is like, I'm wondering if after the two videos that have these HD clips, after those, if I, after I'm like done with those clips, I wonder like how much storage I'm going to have. Let's see. It says that it's taking up. Okay. So my computer has 994 gigabytes um, in total. And uh, photos and videos are taking up 961 gigabytes of that. Wow. <laughs> wow. So literally there's nothing on your computer except for film footage. Yeah. No, seriously. It's like I delete everything. Like y'all know. I love deleting shit. I love unhauling things. It's an illness. <laughs> and I was like, I will go through and be like, okay, this isn't important. Or like, this isn't important. Okay. And I don't do that with my email because it's so overwhelming. Because I swear you can say unsubscribe all fucking day. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. The influence. The influence. Setting. <laughs> <laughs> Upset. Okay, sorry. So, Sarah, what what did you do on the sprint? I I am up to. Let me check. I'm up to fifty four percent of um, Daisy Jones and the Six. Nice. Yeah, you got like twenty percent read in that sprint then. Yeah, it's really fast because I'm on double speed. Yeah. This is real quick. Um, not that, you know, I need to be uh, promoting spending money, but Audible is having a <laughs> two for one sale. So just oh. putting that out there. And I have way too many credits. Well, not way too many, but like I forgot to cancel my subscription, which I want to because I like Libby more, but I forgot. So now I have credits I have to use before they disappear. I use Scribd. I think it's better. I use Scribd too. Uh, I did years ago. And when I used it, and I think this was like a problem that they fixed, but like when I used it, I swear I, it would let me listen to like one book a month and that was it. Mm. Yeah, but, but then you can, even if, if it stops you, if you just start the book, listen to the trial or what is it called? The, the sample? If you just listen to that and then wait a couple of hours, it unlocks. Life hacks. No problem. I can listen to as many books as I want. Damn. Yeah. How much is it a month? Ten ninety nine. Oh, that's hmm. nothing. Well, something like that. Yeah, like the cost of and, one book on Audible. And Fourth Wing is already on it. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Like, yeah, if Scribd doesn't have it, then I just get it from Libby. Um, mm. They have most things. It really lets you just listen to however many you want. How, maybe not how much you read. <laughs> it never has cut off for me. And I've yeah, started me, me stopped either. a ton of books. So. 
But I don't there. think I read more than six months. So. You're planning, <laughs> you're future planning. That's what I'm hearing, Andy. Okay, busy. <laughs> what were you up to? Um, so I got to page um, 120 of uh, the last word. Yep. Um, I don't really have too many theories yet, except for in 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 my head, I just keep hearing this voice of "I'll get you, my pretty yep. and your little dog too." If anyone has read the book, I think you know the voice I'm hearing in my head. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's like that's on a, like a loop right now. But yeah, it's good. It's very much no exit right now. Yeah, it's, it's just it's, like oh, it we starts really start and then like it that, goes okay. running. Yeah, it starts and then it goes off running. Because really like good. we're already running, and I still have like a shit ton to go. I'm like, <laughs> what, what the hell? I'm like, when well, this is gonna be like no exit where it stops, then you keep going. And stop. I feel like no exit. I don't think anything ever stopped. Mm -mm. There'd be like a mo like a pause. I took a breath and then I shot him or something. Yeah. Okay, you're making your way. Love that. Jesus, excuse me. Okay, Amy. Did you go get coffee? Oh no. We can't hear you, Amy. This is, weird. Oh, no. this is not happened to Amy before. I don't know what's happening. Oh. I think it's your connection. Yeah, she's really blurry. Yeah. yeah. It got good for like a second when you just did whatever you did. That was weird. <laughs> well, okay. Well, while, while Amy's technologically struggling for just a second we'll move to Maya and we'll come back um I just ate dinner and watched YouTube what'd you watch um I watched the overnight channel it was the our encounter with the shadow man of haunted Mansfield performatory is that about? like a um a podcast or like a documentary no it's like these five guys go into like these haunted locations and they try to see if there's any proof or whatnot oh. i only want to watch it because it's a it's an old prison and like local to where i live oh. Oh, that's really cool yeah nice. yeah no that's a no from me i stay away <laughs> from ghosts <laughs> no, no paranormal activity over here <laughs> Yep. Same. If I hear a bump in the night, I'm like, okay, I guess I'm dead, but I'm going to get some sleep first. <laughs> it is. You, your, your fourth wing power was so powerful that it's now exploded and everyone. And you're getting the aftershock. Yeah. <laughs> You've used all your powers. What um, what were you doing, Ashley? I uh, listened to one more chapter of uh, Feed. So I'm on yeah. chapter five now. Still good. Is it, like, how long is it? Um, I'm listening at two point uh, two times speed, so it's like six hours, a little over six hours left. I have six okay, because I thought that it was a novella for some reason, but I guess not. Mm -mm. No, it says it's a 13 hour audiobook. Damn, that's yeah, that's yeah. not short. Mm -mm. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> okay, who's next? Me, I read to chapter 13 of mm. Fourth Wing and took my pups for a walk. Cute. I love that. <laughs> I so my boyfriend is in London for two weeks right now. So I was talking to him like that whole time. What's he doing in London? Just for fun. Him and two of his uh friends. Yeah. He's like going to London, Amsterdam, and Brussels. 
Yay! Hey, I'm, in the right I'm in the yeah. Netherlands. So Amsterdam <laughs> is. <laughs> yeah, he's he's like about to have so much fun. Yeah, so I was talking to him the whole time. He like did that. He's like a Jack the Ripper tour yesterday, and then wow. he did the catacombs earlier today too. Um, so they're just like having so much fun. Well, I'm still reading Fourth Wing. I'm I'm almost where Maddie's at. I'm like just behind her every time. So I'm on chapter twelve. Um, which for Amy is the presentation. That's what's happening right now. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so I'm enjoying it, but I am going to leave. Um, I gotta go do stuff and get sleep tonight and I can't be up late again, like last night, but, um, yeah, hopefully I'll finish this book soon. How much farther do you have to go? Well, I'm 30%. Oh, well, yeah. Okay. And basically like two hours last night two hours tonight so easy easy it's Got very it. fast it is very fast but i do have to head out so i just want to say good night everyone or yes. good day to all of our international folks we but yeah we'll see you guys it. next week and uh hopefully everyone is reading fourth wing <laughs> i'm gonna talk about it and i know amy doesn't mind if I just keep sending her these obnoxious messages, mm -hmm. telling her how much I'm loving it, but other people probably want to talk about it too. So, yeah. That's funny. Katie, you have to read it. Sorry. You do. I do. I really do. <laughs> and if I don't like it, I, I'll just, I'll just quit. I'll just, I know, I'll just won't tell anybody. I'll just be like, I, what? I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we don't plan shit. We don't plan shit. Okay. Because once you but plan no it, then it's I'm, an obligation. I'm loving this book, but watch tomorrow when I do like a complete 180 and just like absolutely hate it and just like shit on it. And everyone's going to be like, well, we weren't surprised. We oh, you said that from the beginning. You're loving it so far. I'm loving it so far, but I I like enemies. I don't like enemies to lovers, so I don't know where this is going, but um, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. You know, if you love it, that will say a lot, too. I, think. I better love it. I already bought the book. <laughs> Oh, that doesn't that doesn't say anything. I bought that physical book and I'm gonna keep it even if I hate it. So I hope I love it. You bought like three books at least on last night's print. No, I bought one. I bought one. I, I did buy one anything. today. Huh. Oh. I bought one. I bought Fourth Wing yesterday, and then today I bought McKay's book. Oh. So nice. and I've unhauled zero. So you know. <laughs> it's gonna <laughs> be like, like Whenever you're not just gonna unhaul like one or two books at some point in your life, it's gonna you're just gonna like have like a mental break, and it's gonna be at it's a point where like you're walking across your room and you like stub your toe on like a stack of books, and you're like, mm -hmm. "That's it," and you're just like, "I'm of everything." <laughs> They're just all gonna go. Everything except Nevermore is just gonna go. Be like, it's not worth it. It's not worth it anymore. I love unhauling so much. It is my okay. favorite. I have like no books on this bookshelf. I, I got rid of 150 two days ago. Like, oh, I wow. love it. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. It's so good. I love it. Like, that is all that I have left now are just two shelves. Oh, they're so and, pretty. They're oh, pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can. Oh, I see the Alice Oseman collection. Oh, I have a shrine. A whole shrine. <laughs> yes. I love that. Those are so pretty. Okay, where yeah. did you put your unhauled books? Um, they're in bags that I'm taking them to. Uh, like I, I have like 25 little free libraries in like a five-mile distance from me. So I'll just like drop off bags and bags and bags of them there. I'm going to need you to make a video of this unhaul because Ooh. I'm going to need you to make a video. <laughs> even if you only post it on discord, because I love watching people unhaul shit. I even if you're just that. like this one, it sucked. This one, it was fine. Like that. I need it. 
Well, because <laughs> half of them, half of them were things I was like, I don't know why I got this. Like, I'm never going to read this. Like, I'm never going to read War and Peace. Why did I buy that? But it's so good. It's really I'm good. Never going to do it. The um, the All of Us Villains sequel after, yeah. I was like, well, I, I liked the first one, but why did I get the second one? I'd have to reread the first one to do it. Like, so I'll much. I'll see so one review, that. one review that intrigues me and I'll buy the book and then I'll completely forget why I bought it. Just and then I'll go on hold. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'll do that too. Yeah. Yeah, I don't buy books that I haven't read. That's my goal. That's my goal now. Oh. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah, no, Unhauls are my favorite true. I'm obsessed. Okay. I probably won't be doing anything on this next sprint except getting rid of shit, but that's what I have to do because every time I try to open something, it comes up with a notification saying that I can't open it because I don't have enough storage on my computer. Anyway, LOL, LOL, LOL. Okay. Let's do this. They're saying good night. Good night. To good night. Good night, Alyssa. Good night. Thanks for joining as always. Okay, let's see. Where am I? Cute. Okay. We are going to do another surprise okay let's do it <laughs> sorry i forgot to change the timer once oh, sorry sorry I'm, I'm gonna mute yourself but that's my bad
Hello. Hi. Hello. That meow scares the shit out of me every time. <laughs> like, no, it's coming, but I still jump. <laughs> oh, yeah. And uh, um, if you don't want to be live, because I get it, I got it, then you can always just do it on Patreon, because now we are doing that as well. So, no problem. I was deleting emails that entire time. But I did get from uh, it, um, over almost 1,400 emails to 16. So. Wow. <laughs> did it save me any room? That's great. No. Like, like <laughs> literally, like, less than one gigabyte. And then, okay, what I'm confused on is it says, maybe maybe I'm wrong. So there's two different things. Is it says that, um, uh, like my iCloud storage, which I don't use because I just have like, I don't even know what it's, I don't really get it, but um, I don't use it because I only have like the bare minimum one that you don't like pay for. So it's taking up space. What, how do, can I like get, can I like get rid of that? Like I'm so confused. No. no. <laughs> I pay for like the big iCloud because I needed more space. So I pay like ten dollars a month to get more space. I'll be right back, guys. Just loop back to me. Yes. And then I also was like, I was like, damn, I don't want to delete this because what is it? Is there's like whenever I like type in like Final Cut Pro, I there's all of this stuff in there, but I'm like, I don't know if these are like clips. I have no idea. Listen, we're struggling. We are struggling. That's it. What were you doing, Sarah? You, you, just, you just said my name correctly. Because <laughs> I'm not Sarah, I'm Sarah. Oh! <laughs> First yeah. person in a long time online to say my name correctly because americans just say sarah yeah um let me see um i'm 74 percent into daisy jones and this damn you're gonna finish it today it's flying yeah yeah and it's almost four o'clock a.m <laughs> oh oh my gosh <laughs> <laughs> 945. <laughs> oh. That is that's late. Yeah. Yeah. Or early, depending yeah. on how you look at it. <laughs> okay, so I got to page 160. So I'm basically at the the half I don't know what directions are. There it is. So I'm starting to understand the part of the who, but then it's like, how? Like what? This this, this woman, uh, Taylor over here, like she got me going like, okay, I think I know, but how? <laughs> that's what she has. Like, that's literally every other page. Like, I think I know what's happening, but I don't, I don't understand how that could be happening. But this is happening. Wait, is it? <laughs> she has me questioning my sanity, not just the heroines. Well, I mean, I kind of enjoy that. I'm like, you know, keep me on the edge of my seat. I am. Like, I have no real idea what, where this is headed. I'm, I'm, I'm holding my hands, trying not to spoil. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Amy. Oh wait, are oh. you? We can't hear you. Oh my God, what's happening again? Oh, no. I just, oh my God, I'm so sorry. No, literally, it's because we're it's because we're on public friends because this has literally never happened to Amy before. Who 
was it that a couple days ago they exited and then clicked the link again and it worked? I think it was Kellyanne. I can't remember. Okay, so that's what she's going to do. Okay, Maya. I didn't read. I just kept watching their channel. <laughs> yes. I mean, you look cozied up. I am. Um... Cassie, what have you been doing? Um, I got, I've read about 50, 50-ish pages of We Sold Our Souls, and then I'm still reading A Perilous Undertaking on my Kindle. Oh. I swapped over to that at the last at minute. The last. <laughs> but I do have to start working, like, 10 minutes, so I start, I'm starting later today. It's nearly midday, but, um, yeah, I have to start back on how far are you into the solar solar? Um, not very far. I only started it yesterday. So, yeah. What are you thinking about it? I like it. I don't I like, it like it as much as just the other two so far, but I'm intrigued. Okay. Okay. May, this might not be it, but Amy, do you happen to have the other link still open? No. Okay, it, I was getting a reverb, but now it's gone. So look at that. Amy, what were you doing? Uh, so I was reading more From Below with the spooky ship and um, it, it's getting good. There's like little flashback things of when the ship first sank back in like 1920s. And so they don't know what happened then. We don't know what happened in the modern day. And there's a group of people making a documentary who are diving down to the sunken ship. And uh, there, there's interesting things like someone is maybe not who they claim to be and spooky shit. <laughs> I'm loving it. I'm only like 12% uh, in and, and we're getting spooked. Nice. Okay. Ashley. Um, I got to the middle of chapter six of um, yeah. Speed, and then I also, it was eating some buffalo chicken dip. <laughs> so damn good. <laughs> right, Maddie, did you, did you, are you farther in Fort Wayne? Still, still getting farther. I'm like close to halfway now. Mm -hmm. um, but we're getting there. It's getting exciting. It's been exciting. It's, exciting. it's getting it's really exciting. exciting. I'm going to have to hop on because, because Gabby's yeah. mom made us dinner and Gabby's bringing it home. So I'm about to munch. <laughs> so cute. I love that. You know, adorable. She said she has a surprise for me. So. Oh, we don't get to see it? I'm just kidding. <laughs> we said it's something little. We built this bookshelf for me the other day. Nice. nice. Disgusting. <laughs> that is too cute. I'm sick in. I know, it's gross. Well, that is perfect timing. You got to join us for three hours. I know. Never like happens. I am hoping that on this next break, this will not happen. I'm hoping that this next break, I can find a way for my computer to, you know, uh, be able to do things. Do I think it's going to happen? Do I have faith? No. But I'm going to try. And, you know, I swear to God, I could have been doing so many things in the last, like, two hours. Nope. Nope. I haven't done anything either. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, I'm actually going to edit. And then the universe was like, what if I made it so that you like literally put it? I hate it. So quirky. If anybody has to go, I totally understand. No big deal. Um, because we've been here for fucking ever. Oh my God, wait, Amy, did did you say what you were reading or did I cut you off? No, I'm reading From Below. Oh yeah, you said that, oh my God, okay. Yeah. Woo! 
Perfect timing. Okay. Bye, Maddie. Bye, Maddie. Bye. Bye. See you, Maddie. See ya. And we'll start another sprint to hopefully get things done.
We lost yeah. Katie. <laughs> Oh, uh, you're muted. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I went, um, like, it's still over there. Oh, my God. I literally don't know how to do anything. Okay. Um, I found Actually, you know what? Maya, you start out. I've got to go get this margarita. You go. <laughs> I've still just fallen deeper down in the rabbit hole of YouTube. Nice. Um, I read more of Feed. I got to part two. And then I also read a little bit of Any Man as well. That's such That's a hard, hard book to read. read. Yeah, I haven't yeah. tried it yet. <laughs> I've I've like had I've only like read like parts of it like like every now and every, I put it down because I'm like yeah yeah, yeah like I took a break from it for a while and just picked it up now. I only have twenty minutes left in Daisy Jones and the Six. Oh, so close. Yeah. Nice. But it's no, like everyone has read it. I'm like really late. <laughs> I've never read it. I haven't read any of the Taylor Jenkins read books yet. Oh, uh, okay. I read the, the, the Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't read that one either. I read. Seven Husbands and Malibu Rising. Then you should like the, her, her new one, the Carrie Soto. Hmm. I heard that one is also in the same world. Yeah, it's the same world as Malibu Rising. Hmm. Yeah, busy. You may have to like leave and come back and see if that fixes you because uh we can't hear you oh. okay. Okay. Well. <gasps> are, are you okay <laughs> y'all we're having so many technical difficulties i not only <laughs> okay so i was um struggling obviously with the um backup or whatever and i was like like I, I was like okay i need to like yeah there is an echo can why well, did we just need to like at one point we'll figure out what it is like now it's gone kind of no it's still there i don't know why i don't hear an echo i hear it i don't know if anybody knows what that could possibly be, then... I hear a little it's bit of an echo. Same. I think it's gone. Can you guys hear me? Yeah, now we can. Yeah. 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 Okay. I don't, I don't know, know what, what happened. I don't know what happened. Yeah. Okay, I think wait. it's usually. I'm going to mute myself and then y'all talk. And if it's echoing, not echoing anymore, then it's me. And we'll see if we can figure it out that way. Okay, I'm going okay, to be Their watch screen? What's a watch screen? There's still an echo. Okay. Well, we'll just do it. We'll just we'll just try it out, like, and see if, like, Maya, if you mute yours, if... Is it still... It's still yeah, happening, still right? Yeah. Okay. okay. It's not you, Maya. You're good. <laughs> okay. Ashley. Mm. Oh, no, I think she's frozen. <laughs> okay, Ashley, you, you mute you. It's like a game show now. Okay. <laughs> now I'm scared. It's like, who's it going to be? 
Let's see. I feel like it's still there. Yeah. You okay. well, so, Ashley, you're safe. You're good. <laughs> okay, Seta. <Okay>, All right. <laughs> Let's see. I feel like it's still there. Echo. It, it's still there. Yeah. I still, I still hear it. You win. You win yeah. another. You win another sprint. I'm so scared because I don't hear it. Oh, oh no. Let's see. Is it Amy? Oh no! No, we're sorry. I think it's gone. I yeah, no, I can't hear it. I know. That was not what I expected. I did not expect that at all. This is the only window I have open. I don't understand. I'll leave. I'll come back. Well, yeah, I was like, well, we need to come back, and then I'm gonna Google if like. It's a thing. Um, StreamYard echoing. Oh, well, it pops up immediately. StreamYard echo problem. How to fix the echo? Well, I'm glad that this is a big enough deal that people have feedback. For oh, wait, fuck, I forgot she's coming back. I oh, no, she's not here yet. Um, let's see. Hmm. A feedback loop is present somewhere in the audio chain of your setup. You probably know feedback. Okay. How do you fix it? Enable. Wait, do I have to do that or everybody has to do that? Echo cancellation in StreamYard's audio settings. Maybe that's something I can do and it does it for everyone. This will apply noise compression to the incoming audio signal and cancel out the sound from your device. Or you could wear headphones or turn down your speaker volume so the microphone does not pick up the sound. What the fuck? Okay, listen. We'll give it a go. Audio. Oh, I have echo cancellation. Yeah, I just took mine, mine as well. Mine's on. Mine's on. Mine's on. You did that, Amy? Huh? Mine's been on. The echo, God damn it. That would have been, what if that would have been, what if I had come up with a solution? Like, I like that. No one <laughs> would believe that. Do you still hear the echo? Yeah. Let's see. Um, I feel like it doesn't, is it? Oh shit, yeah. Uh, no, I was gonna be leaving anyway, so. Good. <laughs> <laughs> it's 11 at night. I'll, I'll leave. <laughs> I'm just like, well, I mean, also, because I feel like this does happen a lot. And it's like, if we knew the answer, then. I was hearing it earlier, but I don't hear it now. It's a second. I only hear it intermittently. Oh. Amy, are you using headphones yeah. or are you just using speakers? Like from I'm just using speakers, speakers like everyone else here. <laughs> Uh, so sometimes if it's too loud, that'll cause like a feedback loop for it because then it's picking up what's being said again. So it's like creating almost like an echo chamber that way. Okay. Well, what about you? It's, is this, I feel like it sounds good, right? Did that work? Did it? Oh shit. No. It's like, it was so literally <laughs> today and it was fixed no. for like a second. <laughs> this is rude. How dare this happen to Amy? Well, there's no more reason to invest in headphones. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, you have to have headphones. If you uh, are listening to audio. Well, mine broke, so now I need to get new ones. <laughs> that involves money. <laughs> yeah. Well, there are there are so many headphones that I see and earbuds that are so fucking expensive. And I'm maybe I just don't know because I've never had expensive ones and maybe they're amazing, but I don't really feel like that's necessary. Like technically the ones that the over the ear headphones I have are not like cheap. They're not expensive, but they're not cheap. But the earbuds that I have are so cheap. I think they're like $20 and I've had them for like five years and like dropped them on the ground so many times. Like you literally, you can hear things rattling around in there and they still work like perfectly. So, just seeing. Oh, okay. So, uh, excuse you. Um, yeah, violent. The, <laughs> I was trying to like delete things and I was like, I was like, I need to delete shit. Like, I don't know what I have to delete. Like, I can't delete any of this like 
um, this stuff and are the videos. And I do have like, a, not a lot. I don't think I have a lot. Let me see how many. I have photos that I deleted off my phone and put on my computer because I was like, well, I've got so much space on this laptop. Let me see. I don't feel like I have a lot. <clears throat> Let us say pictures. It's taking up. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. well I have 243. But that's like, that's it though for my whole life. So I feel like that's not that bad. But I was like going through and like try deleting things and being like, okay, like this B roll, like I can get rid of that or I can get rid of this. And like, I, I don't actually need this. And I was like, oh, I want to delete the backup for my iPhone. And then I was like too scared to do it. But then when I looked, the last time my iPhone was backed up was three years ago. And I was like, I don't think I need that. I don't think I need Deleted. that. Deleted. I did, yeah. And it did save a little bit of room. But the only thing that was like so scary, but was like the, this is what I have to do, is that I took, so there's like two vlogs that are taking up so much room. And um, other than whatever. So I have the Sarah vlog and then I have the Hunger Games vlog. And the Hunger Games vlog has 24 clips and the Sarah vlog has 70 clips. But I would be way more upset if something happened to that one because it took me weeks and like I and my family's in it and everything. Um, excuse me. So I took the Hunger Games clips and I airdropped them to my iPad and I'm just hoping that nothing will fuck up when I need to airdrop them back to my computer. And that seemed to help out a bit. And then I went to make a margarita because I was like, I'm stressed. And I had to put it in this super cute cup that I swore I wasn't going to drink out of because you can only hand wash it. But it's oh, sad. Wow. Yeah. Pretty. And then Pretty. I, when I was over there, it took me so long because my, uh, I don't know why this happened, but I washed two new towels and I put them in the dryer and so much lint came off of them that it, it made it so that I couldn't put my vent back in because it was like, so, I don't know. Anyway, whatever. LOL. We're back. What did we do? What did y'all do? Because y'all did stuff and I was just stressed. Katie, do you use an external hard drive? I don't have one. I think they're like 15 bucks. From like Walmart for like a two terabyte. Yeah. yeah. No, yeah. no, no. Literally, they're so expensive. They've okay, gone the down so much over the years. Fancy ones are expensive, and you need to put some on your Amazon wish list because you have a birthday coming up. Exactly. Oh, you do. Yeah. Mine's Go put days. them on. The if they're crazy expensive, I'm not going to. But if they seem mm -hmm. reasonable, then I'll. Honestly, if all you want is to at least clear out your storage, like all of the clips and things that you've already used and you don't need to access all the time, you don't need a super fancy external hard drive. It'll just act almost as if it's a gigantic file. Okay. Because that's what I used to do because um, I, I love taking photos is I would just save them all over there and, and basically it's just geared all towards photos i don't even alter anything mm -hmm. that's what i do too that's a good idea especially because i mean well on my old computer or even now i was filming hd but i wasn't filming 4k and then i i have been doing the 4k thing which final cut pro doesn't like to work with but it takes up so much space and i was like i don't think i actually need to film in 4k like i don't know are people watching this on like their big screen tv like I don't know. I don't know. I could probably just do HD and it won't be a problem. Stuff, stuff. I absolutely watch you on my giant TV. I do yeah. too. <laughs> okay, but y'all would still love me if I was a little yeah. grainier. So. Yeah. <laughs> Katie, can I drop um, a link in the YouTube chat for the hard drive? The yes, hard drive? please. Okay. You might have to do it in the private chat, Travis. Since you're not a mod, it probably won't show up in the regular. Oh, yeah, no, it won't let me. Okay. But you can put it in the private chat. <laughs> Bowen! How much sleep did you get? Oh, my God. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, it's already there. Oh, no. That was on it. 
Hmm. So what were we doing and accomplishing? Bye. -ya. I got nothing accomplished. I fell down a YouTube rabbit hole again. Oh yeah, you said that, my bad. <laughs> oh wait, I got to part two. I got to part two of feed and then uh, read some of any man. Nice, I need to be doing that. Busy? Um, so I got to page 243 of things that Sarah, things are happening. What's going on? <laughs> There's, I'm confused because the things that I thought I thought aren't, aren't what I thought. This, this woman is good. Okay. I have no idea what is happening right now. Okay, Sarah. It's um I'm I have 20 minutes left in Daisy Jones in the six, and then I'm gonna sleep. After that, I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> when how we in the, the world? How how is this ten dollars? This doesn't make any sense. Like, I'm so confused. Like everything else is ninety dollars. They've dropped so much because I have two that I got, I think, like four years ago, and they were like 70 bucks then. It's just technology moves so fast that prices drop so quick on a lot of things. And it also depends on if it has the name brand that will drive mm -hmm. up the price. Very, very mm. much so. It's scary. I, I can find the one that I have and send to you because that's the one that I've been using for like four years. Oh, yeah. What, uh, what were we doing? Who was next? Was it me? I think so. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. <laughs> um, I just started work, so I... Mm. I had to restart my laptop like three times because it didn't want to open anything. Uh, I love that for me. Um, and I'm going to make it a short work day today because I, I really don't have very much enthusiasm <laughs> for it today because it's typically my day off today. So. Why are you working today? Um, I had to take yesterday off instead because um, I have an uncle who's disabled and he needed to be driven to an appointment so I had to my dad and I had to drive two hours to go get him and then half an hour to his appointment and then the appointment took like four or five hours and then we had to drive him back to the home he lives in and then drive back home <laughs> ourselves so god Jesus that's a lot yeah it was a big day <laughs> it was Ooh. a very big day <laughs> okay Amy it's your moment. Your last check-in. <laughs> so I read more from below. <laughs> um, it's everything I want in a spooky ghost ship story. Um, yeah, it, as an enticement, um, they're in the walls is apparently the message that was sent as the ship was sinking. Have you read the Into the Drowning Deep by Mira Grant? I haven't read it yet. It is on my list. It's oh, really good. Really good. Yeah, it's really good. Mm -hmm. What were you Amy, doing, Grant? I um I got to chapter one hundred in Dragon Ball, so now I have I'm on the down slope. I only have ninety four left, <laughs> and then I'll go to Dragon Ball Z after that. How, like, how many volumes would that be? It's, uh, so Dragon Ball itself is only 16, and I'm on volume 9 now. It's really not that long. And then uh, Dragon Ball Z is, I think, 24 or 36. I forget. It's, it's, it's like 370 chapters. Though. That's wild. And then you get, like, Inuyasha that was, like, over 50 volumes. 
Oh yeah, I read uh, I read Bleach in a week, and Bleach is seventy four volumes. Oh, speaking of wow. Bleach, I do not know who the soul is in Atlanta that mu- that gave away their like library of oh. manga because when I went to Half Price Books today, I could not believe I've never seen a, a thrift store Half Price Books anything have this much manga and it was like complete sets like they had like literally uh one through 34 of bleach they had so good um, oh my god it's so good 30 different volumes of haiku it's starting with one so good also so good i was like excuse me they had toilet bound hanako um my dress up darling like they had fucking everything like i was like what is going on and i wanted to ask but I was I was afraid they were gonna say that like somebody died and they like somebody didn't. So I was just like, I'm just gonna make up my own canon and do that. Mm-hmm. I get that. I do. Because mm-hmm. I was like, if you ever if you ever do want a long series, bleaches that's my favorite. Oh. If you ever want to, if you ever want a commitment, <laughs> one of my favorite people of all time. <laughs> I'm not a fan of like long series but i should you know i should try and watch the anime don't do the anime it's rough the anime is rough okay understood it is it is rough (laughs) oh yeah the ending the ending is really good the ending is good like the anime is not bad but the second season is literally none of that happens in the manga like i don't know what they were trying to do there like none of that shit happens Okay, we, I think I'll do, do one more sprint. I don't see myself doing two more. I mean, anything could happen, but I think this will be the last sprint. Also, Jordaline, what are you reading? What are you filming? What's going on? How's the new home? Um, oh yeah, and if you didn't know, uh, Oh my God, is it this month? It's this month, right? That it's Jordan Line and Allie and I are reading. Wait, shit. I don't remember. One of, I can't remember if it's this one or next month, but in June, I know that Jordan Line and I, I think are both reading Any Man. And then the month after that, Allie and Jordan Line and I are reading. One yeah. Yeah. Any Man is in May. And one for my yeah. enemy is in June. Thank you. And then yellow face is July. Wow. Yeah. Yep. There you go. There Sounds you go. Sounds like you got August. Mm-hmm. Hi. <laughs> okay. We're going to do... Oh. Um, I don't... Oh, I do like that. The Way of Shadows is really good. Mm-hmm. It's, it's a fantasy. It's an assassin fantasy series. It's by Brent Weeks. Mm-hmm. Way of Shadows. Oh. It got new covers that like are so much better than the old covers. The perfect killer has no friends, only targets. It's 650 pages long! Yeah, it's <laughs> long. <laughs> that's, that's normal for fantasy. Mm-hmm. She, Jordan has been working on this for months. <laughs> okay. We're doing do another sprint. We're gonna say goodnight to Amy, who's gonna actually get rest. <laughs> night, Amy. Maybe, night. maybe rest. And I'm She'll... gonna go to sleep after the after I finish Daisy's Jones. Yes, awesome. And if you if you leave um, before, then uh, type just like put in the comments what you rated it because I'm interested oh, okay. or what you think. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Literally. Okay. Okay. We're going to start another sprint. Good night to everyone who is leaving. And I'm glad that you joined me. And I know I'll see y'all again on Patreon. Okay. Let's do it. Happy reading or struggling like me. Okay. <laughs>
Hi. Hi. Hey. Oh, so aesthetic. The, best. Oh. the last survivors. Yes. <laughs> and this was, um, I was like, this was five and a half hours, which is pretty damn good. It would be mm -hmm. better if I had read something. <laughs> but I did, um, at the beginning of that sprint, for some reason, I, I do not know why, but for some reason, my computer went from having like 10 gigabytes of storage that I, that I could use to maybe add in another clip to this video to back up to exactly where it was before. I don't know why, but um, I deleted some stuff or whatever. So hopefully it's okay. And I did start editing the video and I swear when I tell you it's like old because I am editing this part right now where Rachel, um, Gabby's sister, sent me the Summer Ween stickers. And I'm like, oh my God, she, wait, they're right here. She sent them to me so long ago. And I'm like just now getting to the footage. But like when I tell you, she packaged this, if anybody is ever wanting to buy anything from her from Etsy, uh, she packaged this so well. And it had like cardboard in it to keep. And then she's got these cute little stickers, remarkably rage. It was so cute. I'm like, wait, let me show you the best one. This one. Look at that color scheme. That is sickening. Ugh. And then it's in this. July, right? Or June? Uh, I believe July. Oh, July. Okay. For a second, I thought it was June, and I'm like, uh oh. <laughs> No, yeah, no, it doesn't it stop. Is, is it the 7th of July? It's the 7th of July because the 6th yeah. of July is Olivia's birthday. That's my sister's birthday as well. 6th of July. Oh. Yep. And then this one. It's freaking bats. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, LOL. So I was doing that. Uh, I think in the in grand total of this whole sprint, I have only edited two minutes. <laughs> But it's, you know, it's better than nothing. And I was, um, I, I went to Joanne's today and I, Joanne's Fabrics, and I haven't been to Joanne's since like high school. And I got caught up in the Joanne's craze and I just, I just bought so much shit. I mean, I, I did save a lot of money, but like, I was like, this is a sick chain. I'm going to buy that. Like, <laughs> why? I don't know. Or like, this hair clip, it's Joanne's fabrics. Like, why am I shopping for hair accessories? And it's because I don't go to the mall. That's why. Anyway, LOL. Okay, so Maya, what did you get done on our last point? Um, in the very beginning, I opened my door, my cat came in and jumped all the way up onto the top of my bookshelves. So now I have to hopefully wait for him to climb down the correct way, or I have to get a chair and grab him um, because my bookshelves aren't mounted to the wall and he will jump off and knock all of them down. So we're just hoping he doesn't jump. And then I finished like the first part of a discussion post. Mm -hmm. Well, we are hoping for the best for that. That was for damn sure. <laughs> Actually... Um, I just, I did nothing. I just scrolled TikTok and I also said uh, bye to my husband who worked overnight. He was, he had to go to work. Yes. Oh yeah, yeah, because yeah, you did that yesterday too. Yeah. I remember I was like, damn, that was the fastest goodbye I ever saw. He was swift. <laughs> he was in a hurry. <laughs> yes, I, I did, but it was weird and I don't know if this is a thing, but it popped back up like when I deleted the Hunger Games footage because I put it on my iPad and it just popped back up whenever I said like, oh, what is the footage that's taking up the most space? It was clips from the Hunger Games and I was like, what? But it's not in my downloads anymore. But it was in a specific file called like high quality, um, high quality media and then another one called proxy media. And I was like, what the fuck is that? So I deleted those and, and it worked. I don't know. We'll hope for the best. Anyway. Rabba, what did you do? I, I got to chapter 119 in Dragon Ball. So I ended up reading 19 chapters that and then 60 total today. That's fucking nice. crazy. Like, that is literally wild. Yeah. Like, it, people are like, oh, yeah, like chapters of manga aren't that long. I'm like, they are, though. Like, 
Some, yeah, it depends on, because, like, some of them have a lot more words than others. Like, Hunter Hunter, it's like reading a novel. And, like, Monster in 20th Century Boys, it's like reading a whole-ass novel. Monster, absolutely. I think you would really like 20th Century Boys. It's by the same author. That is the only uh, manga that I put below my shelves, because I was like, oh, I'll just keep the first three to if I want to like recommend it to people and I can like hold it up and know that I love the series. That's the only one that I am pretty much sure I'm going to change my mind and move all of them back up to the top because I was like, no, I need to have the entire series. Like it's so good. It's like one of the greats. Like it's still considered like just the, the anime too is incredible. Like it's just, it's so good. It I haven't so good. seen the anime, but it's also like, and I get that this is not the preferred method or the method that you should use but i only watch dubbed anime because mm -hmm. i don't want to read subtitles mm -hmm. i already read a lot okay yeah no i get that i do do they not have it in uh dubbed at all i i remember I'll, that i was I'll... researching it but i can't remember if i didn't find anything or or what happened with that i'll look it up for you and let you know real quick <laughs> Okay, busy. Okay, so I had to stay up an hour after my bedtime, but I finished it. Yay! And I need to collect my thoughts. Wait, what um what did you start on? Like 70? Well, I actually started um I started the book on the sprints. Amazing! Oh my god, that's no, this, so this nice. thing was one sprint. Wow, that's stunning. I call but, it. So I don't think I like it as much as No Exit, but it's really good. Okay, as long as it is leaps and bounds above Hairpin Bridge, I will. I get never it. read it, but just based on the video of yours that I have watched more than once, just because your facial um, expressions are incredibly funny. <laughs> Um, <laughs> and I like to sometimes, you know, enjoy your pain. Yeah. Fair. So literally that book, I just refuse to believe the same man wrote it. I, I, I don't think it's real. I don't think it's real. I think somebody hacked his account. Like it's just, <laughs> no. Taylor or Adams could... is a man. Yeah. I just I learned that, that too. I was just going to sort of hop over it. <laughs> I had no I thought idea. It was oh no, yeah, I'm too. sorry. That's like Riley Sager. Like he goes by that pin name so that people will think he's a woman. I never thought mm -hmm. that it was a woman. I always thought that it was a man. And then Taylor Adams, I also was like, oh yeah, it's a man. But you know what? Listen, Taylor Adams, he gets the pass. Okay. He gets the pass. He, he writes some damn, you know what? Listen, he writes female protagonists, but all I can speak on is no, uh, no exit, but Darby Thorne, she was if badass. you if you liked Darby, then you're gonna like this chick. Okay, good. Because she's just like, you know what? I'm gonna murder you. F you ain't. No, you ain't. I'm gonna murder you. Like that's basically the whole conversation. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. Uh, uh. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I can vibe with that. That sounds. That and sounds it's just fun. who's gonna get who first. I yeah. like that in No Exit. It wasn't like the Riley Sager. Like, oh my god, I'm gonna get with the person that's like probably like the most suspicious of that suspect it was like she was like kind of like getting with like one of the dudes who you know was a suspect but it wasn't because she was like oh my god i'm into him she was like he has muscles and if i get him on my side then he can help me and i was like yes uh, and i don't want to die work work the system <laughs> okay cassie you were doing work how far are you into your work day um I've got about an hour of work left and then I have to take my dog to the vet. So why? You know. Oh, he just, he's got some, he's only little, but you know. I'll grab him. Oh, this oh, is Winston. Oh, so he is five. He's a bearded baby in his jammies because it's cold oh. here. <laughs> and now he's mad. <laughs> he's but, like, excuse me, mother. Little, he <laughs> Uh, injured himself and that triggered arthritis so he has oh, to get yeah. injections every month to slow the 
the effects of the arthritis. So it's just a just a routine visit. Damn. But I did about an hour of work and I made some rice with dumplings for lunch. Is that like something that people get too, like, uh, or humans get like um, injections or is that like not something that's available for? Uh, I don't actually know. I never thought about it. I work in a nursing home. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, cool. My mom's a nurse. A lot of animal medications are human medications. So, because he used to be on anxiety medication, yeah, it was the same one, one of the same anxiety medications I've taken before. Okay, <laughs> I, I, I like that. That's a that's a cool relation to have with your dog. <laughs> it's like, oh, you got problems? So do I. Yeah. Same same. Yeah. <laughs> Technically, like when you see all those TikToks of people with anxiety who got a dog with anxiety. Well, also. Yeah. That whole, like, how pets and owners start looking alike. Totally true. It's so yeah. true. It is so true. Yeah. Yep. They're basically your children. From? I've not heard of that. Mm -mm. Haven't heard of it. Oh, okay. Gave it four stars. That's still damn good, though. That's still a good rating. Like, especially with how hyped you were for it, like, how much expectation was. I feel like four stars is really good if you went into it with the level of expectation that one would go into for Daisy Jones. Um, mm -hmm. oh. Mm -hmm. Sad. Katie, I found the English dub for you, oh. um, but it's like through a back website. Like, so what, what they did is they only released the first 15 episodes um, like on a DVD, but they did record and release it on TV. So like, there's no way to legally watch it is what i'm saying but i uh i won't be sending you a link on instagram when this ends yeah travis how you know how dare you won't won't at all be doing that the four of us <laughs> can testify that they yeah. were not planning any form of illicit activity mm -hmm. in fact yeah. it was in fact denied I like, did in not fact do none that. of us were even here <sighs> The shame I would bring upon me and mine. <laughs> she would I, never. Listen, I thought that I would regret it, but now looking at these little chains, I'm like, they're so cute. I loved him. <laughs> and I was like, also, I couldn't leave without these. Oh, cute. Oh, oh they're cute. God. You know, sometimes you just need something shiny. Yes. And they were like all discounted and i called my mom because she loves joanne's fabrics and she had just been there and she was like she was like well you know what they tend to do is they'll say something is discounted but then the original price is way more than it should be and i was like shh, shh. i can't hear you and i will not respond <laughs> nightmares and dreamscapes also haven't heard of that but we all know that i don't really watch things because if I start to watch things I'll pull a suits and watch all nine seasons instead of reading I know I'm really just trying to find the perfect right like show to introduce you to to let's complete like up in your world there's so many like there's so many that I'm like I know that I would love yellow jackets I know that I would love squid game but I deleted Netflix because even though all right I um unsubscribe from it because I knew that I wasn't watching anything. And I was like, I'm spending money on this every month for what? Like I do not watch it. I mean, I haven't even finished. Six yeah, six six two. I haven't watched season two yet. I haven't either. Me neither. It's getting mixed reviews, but I, I was scared about that because I love the crow so much in the show, but from what I've seen online and like not spoiling it, but, um, it, it, this is not a spoiler at all. But the thing that people are upset about isn't anything about the crows. It's that the the ending to Shadow and Bone is is somewhat different than the book, and people were upset about that. Where I was like, I was upset about the ending in the book. So I feel like that may mean that I like. Yeah, I read that series twice, and I don't remember the ending. I actually like the TV show more than the books. 
Mm -hmm. I read the first. At least the first, at least more than like the like tr trilogy. Yeah. I like the first season more. I remember yeah. that too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I liked the first season more than the first Shadow and Bone book, but not more than Six of Crows. Oh, no. Yeah. Six of Crows. Yeah. Good. Yeah. But There's all of the people they the got part. were the people I imagined. Yeah. In my head, especially Kaz. Yes. Like that, yes. that was who yes. I was picturing it. Like when they announced him, I'm like, when he, they, when he was just like dressed normally, I'm like, eh, no. And then they showed him as Kaz and I'm like, yes. Well, mm -hmm. I think Kaz and Jesper are the two that I was like, this is spot on casting spot on casting everybody else i could see different people playing them well i feel like matthias is pretty spot on but everybody else i could see somebody else like maybe taking up the role but like dude jesper oh my god he's so good like i, I perfect <laughs> although why is wyland a brunette in the show like, i don't where's know my little like ginger headed baby yeah. No. I don't know if you can like, see, the only thing that I can think about that is you can dye an actor's hair, but I feel like you can't dye somebody's hair to look like a natural redhead. Like, No, um, I worked in like um, a beauty store, like as a makeup person for about two years, I worked at Ulta and redheads have a, have a very specific skin tone and mm -hmm. underlying skin tone. It's one of the things that makes them so prone to skin cancer. But yet yeah, you cannot fake being an actual born and bred redhead. Mm -hmm. it's, it's one of the few colors you just like, people will know that you are not a natural redhead. And I feel like people, when they dye their hair red, it's like they go for the more like, crimson or like dark where normally when i see someone who has like has no like uh is born with red hair it's like a more of an like an orange undertone mm -hmm. it's like a like, rust yeah oh yeah my my best friend's husband total like redhead and it's like a rusty orange and his daughter you know same big mop of rusty like this but orangey Literally, okay. born a redhead. She's brunette now. Okay, no, she's blonde and shilter <laughs> because she we we don't know what a natural color looks like anymore. <laughs> but she was born a redhead, um, and yeah, it was like orange. Yeah, it's so wild to me when you see pictures of kids and then their hair color changes like naturally. Mm -hmm. That is wild. I was born blonde. My hair like was like, I had like really yeah. light blonde hair when I was born. For years, when I was a kid, the, the ends of my hair were blonde. That's insane. Like My hair color didn't change, but my hair texture did. I used to be pin straight, and now it's curly. That actually mm -hmm. is something that's documented. That it, it just, it can happen. It didn't happen until like middle school. I didn't know how to handle it. That's wild. That yeah, that didn't. Yeah. I was like, curly from the womb. Yeah, my <laughs> hair, the color, and my brothers and everything have been the same. Except it's so funny that my brother's hair from when he was born was curly, and it still is. And mine, no, like not at all. Oh, my sister's hair is pin straight. Like she could. She's one of those people that she can't even like put a hair tie in her hair because it'll just like slowly slide off mm -hmm. and mine gigantic curly i know yeah. if i curl my hair it doesn't stay like mm -hmm. even if i put like a bunch of hairspray like yeah my hair yeah you have to basically curly. crunch it <laughs> yeah yeah i it well maybe it was florida but when i lived in florida i could not curl my hair like it would never stay in like even for prom, like the lady was like, I'm doing my best. I'm sorry. And then when I moved Humidity. to Atlanta, what? Humidity. Yeah, that was, that's what I was going to say too. It's the humidity. Yeah. I would have thought that that yeah. would have like made it stay better, but 
No. No, it does the exact opposite. It's a very humid climate most of the year. Yeah, it's the humidity. (laughs) Yeah. I grew up in Mississippi, so, like, that's how I know so much about the humidity on it. Because water will get rid of whatever you've done to your hair, either with a product or with a curling iron. And with high humidity, it's almost like water is being applied to your hair. Yeah. It's just doing it in little mists. But hum- water is getting on your curled hair. That's what's happening. That makes sense. Also, whenever I lived in Florida, I had, like, this weird, like, my hair would, like, so it would frame my face on one side, and the other side it would go in the same, like, way. And it was so annoying, and I would straighten the shit out of it. And then I moved to Atlanta, never again. And I was like, this doesn't even feel like humidity. This feels like just the evil of Florida. (laughs) Well, I mean, right now, yeah, I keep seeing that meme of Bugs Bunny, like from a cartoon, and he's sawing Florida off and floating it out to sea. (laughs) Yeah. Uh Uh-huh. It's, um, you know, there are beaches. (laughs) There is that. Okay. I, I mean, Australia is an Australia. island, guys. We have lots of beaches if that's what you want, and uh, no Florida. No Florida. <laughs> that's that's going to be like the catchphrase of every tourist spot in the world. Come to mm-hmm. us. We're not Florida. <laughs> Yikes! This sounds so intriguing, though. Like, what the fuck? Ooh. That sounds really. Mm. Huh. That sounds good. Yeah, that sounds. Okay, I am going to end it here, so that we do not just as yesterday, but today it's on public, so we got to we got to wrap a little bit earlier because I I did eat like I ate, but apparently it wasn't enough. So we do not want to get on the wrong side of tipsy on public internet. On Patreon, we can edge that line. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I love that this is probably not having anything to do with what I just said, but I feel like it does. <laughs> Hi. Okay. So we've been here for six hours. That's pretty damn good. I feel like this is kind mm-hmm. of like where we're hitting our stride with the with the group. Sprints where, like, we can just go way longer on the group yeah. sprints, in my opinion. Yeah. So, thank you all so much for joining me, the people that are here and the people that are watching and the people that had to leave. If you're watching later, I appreciate you. If you, you know, I, Amy is telling me in my mind to do this. Amy's telling me in my mind that I need to be better about talking about myself. But if you, are watching and you like this and you want to do it yourself and you want to join the Patreon, you go like, God, if you don't like it. But if you don't want to, that's totally fine. It's no big deal. Literally no big deal. Like it's just reading sprints. It's not like we're out here making cash money. You know what I'm saying? Like we're just, we're doing what we love. Okay. Thank you all so much. We are going to leave for tonight and we will, well, I don't know what I'm going to see. YouTube again, but I'll see Patreon.